Hey, what's good, baby? What's good, baby? It's your boy K Camp back with another episode of the K Camp Chronicles, episode eight, baby, season one, fam. And uh, it's a little special edition, you know what I'm saying? Ah, I don't call it special edition. Basically, I'm gonna be talking about my experiences on the job and as well as previous jobs that I worked at, man. And uh, hey, man, let's go ahead and hop into it. So. The first story I'm gonna tell y'all about is basically when I was working at a water park and I was about 18, you know, before I was heading up to college, right? So basically, we in the we in the store, right? You know, cause it was a store in the water park and um it was me and this girl, she's a German chick, man. She was like 5'11, 5'10, man, like Amazon, bro. And he had another chick named Olivia, right? So Anyway, we're in the stove. You know your boy K Count, you know what I'm saying? You always gotta come with that wisdom. You always gotta say something smooth, you know what I mean? But <laughs> but I'm being truthful though for real. So um I'm talking to Olivia and to me I'm talking about her. I'm talking to her about polygyny. Now this is like around the time I was just coming out of GMS, you know what I'm saying? Just just hitting the new covenant, bro, like still a baby, dog. Like only two years in the truth. So I'm talking to her about polygyny. Basically telling her like, look, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is how this is how it's supposed to go. You know what I'm saying? It's supposed to go like this. And I ain't gonna lie, Shadi was smiling, bro. She was smiling, bro. I ain't gonna lie. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Busting a little bit. So I actually asked her though. I said, hey, um, like if you was put in that position, you know what I'm saying? You had a righteous man. Like, like how would you respond to that? And she talking about, oh well, you know, you know, it's his choice, and you know. And next thing you know, the other German chick, man, she walked in there too. So I'm talking about the same thing. And uh, yo, to me, after like talking for a little bit, man, all of a sudden she was like, she said, look, um, I would marry a guy like you, but you know, I don't, I don't want my parents getting mad. And Olivia, like she in the back, like low key, like, you know what I'm saying? Low key, low key, smiling hard as hell, bro. I'm talking about hard, so, but, um, yeah, man, but the second time, like at my previous job in the summer, right? So basically I'm working, at, I'm working at a restaurant, you know what I'm saying? To do what I gotta do, pay rent, is right down the street, literally walking distance. And you know what I'm saying? Still in college, still doing my thing. And uh, so, like I said before, I work around I work around 95% of females, you see what I'm saying? So I'm in the spirit of your house shy. Like I gotta like literally zone out. My first time actually working in human services, so I'm like, damn, it's not really like what I'm used to. But like sometimes, like the Lord just puts you in a saucy spirit where you just you you successful at everything, man. So anyway, dog, tell me why. Like it was one night. This happened on multiple occasions, like multiple occasions. One chick named Taylor walked outside. You know what I'm saying? And like I'm reading her the order. You know what I'm saying? Giving her a food on some ti, whatever you like type stuff. All of a sudden, man, I'm finna walk away. She's like. Hey, hey, um, can I have your number? Can like, can I just Snapchat? Bruh, this woman would not stop texting me, man. So wh- whether I have the fade or whether I don't have the fade, man, I still get hit on. Then we still gotta talk about RB down in the mix. You know what I'm saying, then we gotta get to the other little girls, man. So look, this other chick named Emma at my job, right? So it was Emma, RB, like. Man, bro, just know it was 95. Like, because all the girls work in the front. It's only like, when I was working, only like two dudes in the front, including the manager. Most of them were in the back. And it's like, low key, man, they felt, I'm gonna be real, y'all. I honestly feel like they felt protected around a young king, bro. Because I'll be sitting there, like, and they'll be like, oh, he's not, he doesn't do anything. He doesn't help nothing. Ooh. But like, I'm getting 100% job reports from the mystery shoppers. You know what I'm saying? Mystery shoppers. Random people, you know what I'm saying? Go buy stuff. Anyways, you know what I'm saying? They, they in there, bro. And my manager, she gonna call me a doll and all that. So, Emma, right? So, they all, you know what I'm saying? I'm already like 21. I'm 21 years old. And like, I'm already in that spirit of like, you know what? I'm on Shadi Yala. Just working my patience. You know, being woman emotional too. And I don't touch thotties, man. Big up. So, Emma, I keep saying, she always wanted to like flirt with me and stuff, you know what I'm saying? In in a, in, a, in a way, you know what I'm saying? And like always playing around. Arby would always like, you know what I'm saying? She would always like touch my, like hit my arm, you know what I'm saying? So I'm already peeping signs. 
but I don't like extra friendly women like that. You know what I'm saying? I like feminine friendly women, but what I mean by being friendly is like you flirt with everybody. But maybe like on the other side, sometimes baby, if you just look good, man, you just look good, man. Go ahead and accept it. You look good. Like what I, what I call it, a Hershey bar. And I still got to touch on Alexis, man. So Alexis actually hit me up one day. She was like, man, I ain't gonna lie, I miss you a little. Out of nowhere, bro. Out of nowhere. But you could, but working on a job, you would think that, you know what I'm saying, they hate me. So my manager actually told me though, she was like, nah, like all the girls like hitting on you, man. And one of the girls even became an assistant manager, bro. Like what the hell? So another time I walk outside, yo, it's like six cars lined up in the parking lot, fam. It is six, like six to seven cars lined up in the parking lot. Busy night. I think I was looking good. I don't know. But anyway, I walk outside and there's another, there's this other vanilla cake, vanilla cake named Alexis. I think it's named Alexis. But, bruh, tell me why I come back outside and your boy using his charm, his charisma, because that's how I work on the job, bro. Like, I gotta, like, be in my zone. I gotta be in my K-Kim zone. So, especially when I'm on my feet all day and it's not my career job, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't hate it at all, you feel what I'm saying? Actually, because I was making hella tips, I ain't gonna cap, because, bro, it was, it was older women, like, hitting on me, dog, like, smirking. Like, it, it'll be a time where, like, say a woman will pull off, you know what I'm saying, she'll pull off, and she'll stop the car, bro, and turn around and give me $5 tips, bro. Be smiling, bro, I'm trying to tell you, bro, Latinas and all, bro, like, the boy, camp are dangerous. But look, um, Alexis was like, hey, like, Everybody can't be as cute as you can count. And I'm being like, man, I'm a pretty boy. But, so, long story short, she was like, hey, can I have your snap? You know what I'm saying? She was like, hey, do you got a girlfriend? They always ask me that all the time, you know what I'm saying? So, but I'm not, K Camp not finna be no backup, you know what I'm saying? I'm not finna be no leftover, bro, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm like, nah, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm single, you know what I'm saying? So, but, disclaimer, I'm not on that because they were young, bro. They like 19, 18, like, you 21. Still, bro, like these 2000 babies, they something else, boy. That's off the mm -mm. but uh, so look, basically, you know what I'm saying? I forgot what else happened. Oh, so I had texture that night, right? And uh, basically, I said, Yo, um, why was all y'all staring at me? You know what I'm saying? Like, again, I'm walking past and like all eyes on me, you know what I'm saying? Mind you, there's other workers outside, but they all staring at me. And she was like, I'm not gonna lie, like, it's your energy, like. I was like, damn, girl, my energy, she was like, yeah, like, your energy, you know what I'm saying? And I ain't gonna lie, like, you know what I'm saying, they, they be trying to melt camp at the job, you know what I'm saying? Because like, I got this shirt on, right? Sometimes, you know, you got some muscles, too, you know what I'm saying? Hey, sometimes, hey, like, just work like that. And then Alexis actually told me that she doesn't expect a guy like me to, a guy like me to be working there, you know what I'm saying? And I told my counselor, I said, hey, look. I said, real talk, man, I will go to Ohio State. I'll go to Ohio or Oregon, get me a, a virtuous vanilla cake who want to follow the Yahweh. Yeah, and the truth, bro, all virtuous Latino, or whoever chocolate cake, whoever, baby. You know what I'm saying? Because, but I just be in the spirit of Yahweh Shah, man. But again, Olivia, you know what I'm saying? Uh, bruh, she talking about, again, the two white girls, like, you know, I would date you, but, you know. And then I had another, you know what I'm saying, my, my uncle's friend, she actually, no, he actually wanted me to marry her daughter, bro. So-called white dude, fam. You know what I'm saying? She had a kid now, but, bro, this stuff, bro, it's obviously happening. And then I still got to take it back to, let's see, I said RB, oh, the other chick, bro, I forgot her name, but. Next to this Persian girl named Summer Faruqi, right? This is this is red hair chick. I used to go to my high school, right? And so basically, fam, I didn't say this, but old girl in episode five, Miracle was extremely submissive to me, fam. Extremely submissive, bro. I didn't even have to raise my, I didn't have to do nothing, bro. She was just like head over heels submissive. So this other chick, red hair chick, right? You know what I'm saying? I forgot her name, but she was so shy, bro. So I be sitting there, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing my work. Pretty P English, hard as hell. You know what I'm saying? I'm not in my really, I'm not in my vibe, you know what I'm saying? But pretty P English. And first of all, like, bro, she would look back, you know what I'm saying? She'd look back at me. And like she would always just blush, bro, all the time. She would just 
look away super fast and then when she spake she was like super like shy you know what i'm saying it's like she was looking at me the whole time I'm like girl like look 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 get your confidence up i know you i know you see k camp here but just speak baby i ain't on you like that bro i ain't on you like that baby look you know and in summer she doing the same thing bro she like bro she rubbing her leg bro already i'm a 15 year old i'm already seeing the signs bro i know what it is man and i was a new kid in school everybody bro i'm getting all these reports man they think you so fine bro the chick named Haley, bro. I'm a, matter of fact, I ain't gonna show her, bro. Light skinned chick, Colombiana, man. But my bro was like, hey, man, like, bro, she, I fucking you, bro. And I promise you, bro, I ain't, I don't, I don't chase females because I want a shawty that fit me. You know what I'm saying? So you, you already come with a natural different energy, bro. I'm just a different dude, bro, like for real. But of course, besides that, everybody trying to control you and all that BS. But. Yeah, man, that red hair chick, bro, was super shy. Like, bro, she liked me a lot, man. Like, a lot. It was getting awkward, bro. And then this girl named Addie, bro. It was like her and this girl named Katie. Just, I'll be in biology, fam. And like, bro, they would they would break their neck to look at me, bro. This other this other Cuban chick ain't lowly, fam. Who, bro, bro, she would break. They would, they would, bro, they be breaking their neck, breaking their neck to look at me, fam. So. The thing about it is though, my, my English teacher, she was like, hey, you know what I'm saying? You'll make a great father one day, you know what I'm saying? And I'm like, bro, y'all, hey, man. Y'all, hey, y'all done tripped out, man. Like, people is tripping. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, people are tripping. Because the KKM Chronicles, man, that's something serious. So, I, I ain't gonna lie. I just thought about that because I actually gotta go to work today. And uh, YouTube banned me for like a week. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, who does that, bro? How you, how you banned me for a week over a video that you took down, fam? I don't understand that, bro. I don't understand that, bro. But look, the KK Chronicles, oh yeah, bro. And I stay getting hit on, fam. I stay getting hit on, fam. So look, man, with that being said, that was episode eight. I didn't really want to put no comics today because, you know what I'm saying, I ain't want to go search for them pictures. See what I'm saying? I ain't want to go search for them pictures, but <laughs> look, man. <sighs> look, man. KK Chronicles. It's all good. All good. So, y'all stay in the new covenant. Y'all stay in the spirit, man, because people out here, like, really, really trying to work. They really trying to work. So with that being said, your boy out, AKA the Shardy Tamer himself. And uh, yeah, man. That person chick I told you all about, I forgot to add this. Yo, tell me why she actually told me one day, or at least like in front of me talking about she wants some black babies, man. I'm trying to tell y'all, bro, the foreign Shardy's obsessed over chocolate, bro. I'm not, bro, I'm not playing about this, bro. Like. They obsess over chocolate, so I mean, you crayons that get mad, oh goddamn well, you sit your ass down, cause you wouldn't wear, you wasn't worried, you was not worried about none of that. You know what I'm saying at all. <laughs> but yeah, man, I just had to, I just had to add that real quick, bro. Cause dudes be tripping, dudes be tripping, man. I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think. Oh yeah, even Martha. I mean, they, nah, man. But yeah, man, I'm out this time for real, though. Forgot to say, man, that I forgot to add, bruh. See, also, this, this girl named Nada, this other chick ain't gonna say her name, but a lot of them always just be like, oh, you know, um, um, any girl be lucky to have you, you know what I'm saying? I be like, look, man, like, I'm just keep being humble, you know, let things flow, you know what I'm saying? all the time because people bro people family friends everybody always wants you to get out your own zone bro so but look i i mean you just be in the light man but yeah bro like i said i got that a lot man like you know any girl would be lucky to have you you know what i'm saying Cause once they figure out who i am for real you know what i'm saying then it's all good you know i just had to add that in there you know what i'm saying <laughs>